This study investigated the relationship between glutamatergic dysfunction and treatment resistance in individuals with schizophrenia. It found that treatment-resistant individuals had lower levels of glutamate in their anterior cingulate cortex than both treatment-responsive and control subjects. Additionally, they showed reduced activity in the right dorsolateral prefrontal cortex and left parietal association cortex when compared to the other two groups. In contrast, treatment-responsive individuals showed significant signal decreases in the anterior chordate compared to the other two groups. These findings suggest that glutamatergic dysfunction may be responsible for the lack of response to antipsychotics seen in some individuals with schizophrenia. Furthermore, this study suggests that the cortical and subcortical reward learning substrates are differentially affected by glutamatergic dysfunction in these individuals, which could have implications for future treatments. This article was authored by Elias D. Muchlianitis, Lucy D. Vaines, Derek K. Tracy, and others. We are article.tv, links in the description below.